Hey guys, welcome back to John's Watch. Today I'm taking a look at a new game called Poncho. That Poncho was released on Steam on November 3rd, 2015. Trigger price is $16.99 Canadian, that'll be $14.99 US. And it's developed by Delve Interactive and published by Rising Star Games. Now the game Poncho is about a robot, a poncho, and a journey of discovery. It's a 2.5D platformer, so very similar to Fez. A lot of the art style looks very similar to Fez. You can kind of see it in the main menu, but uh, you'll definitely be able to see it more as we get into the game. It's got full controller support, so I'm going to be playing it with a controller, because I just think platformers are better with controller. And we're just going to hop in right now. We've got twinkly yet pixely stars there. And not much else. Beautiful 60 FPS though. Well done. <laughs> Whoa. There's trees or clouds or something. Whoa, look at all those buildings. So I'm getting a bit of a sci-fi vibe from it already. It does say there's a robot, so I mean that pretty much automatically means it's sci-fi. <laughs> Quite a lengthy intro though. <laughs> I think that said this is the end, and now everything is on fire. <laughs> this is like, like a trippy music video or something. <laughs> what a bizarre intro. <laughs> Whoa, rip, the thing goes everywhere. Hopefully you're not epileptic watching this. <laughs> Aha! Wow. Isn't this like pretty much Fez's like starting room? I'm a little robot, whole day to jump, okay. Okay, you can tap it or you can do a big jump. Oh, cool. Look how much I can jump. Fantastic. You wanna watch this TV? He can't jump on much, can he? Oh yeah. Oh god. No. Yes. Off into the shadows. Go little poncho robot. Is he wearing a poncho? He is wearing a poncho. So I guess the robot and the poncho are one and the same. Got a little, little red thing. Red money or something. Possibly. Oh, cool. Neat. Gotta make sure I'm not missing any red things. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, God. Why would it spawn me there? Oh, no. I'm not very good at platformers. Oh, don't forget that. Yay. Oh. Okay. Press right bumper to shift forward. Oh, cool. How do I, how do I, how do I go back? Okay, I have to jump. Cool. Oh, I probably have to get in it to, to go. I think. <laughs> yeah. Neat. That's pretty cool. I've never actually played Fez. I just watched Robbie play it for however long he played it for. Aha! Neat. <laughs> so cool. Oh, I like this. This is neat. You have to jump to get there. Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, I haven't played Fez, just watched Robbie's video on it. Although I did hear that Fez was fantastic. Oh no! I went the wrong way. I'm being timed. Oh, that's scary. I got a key. X. Hooray! Okay, I'm getting better at the... Oh no! Getting better at the not platforming parts. Oh, I don't like being timed. I'm stressing. 
<laughs> oh no, I didn't get it. Oh no. I've only got a minute, oh god. Better hurry up, little fella. Can I make that in one go? Yeah. Do, do, do. It's a rocket, let's go! To the moon! I don't actually know if that was a rocket. <laughs> I don't think it was. It was a wormhole flux... hole. So... You have finally woken, young Ponchwoman. Welcome back, my child, my son. If you are hearing this, then you are watching a video. That means that I have failed, and the world has ended. It did look like it had ended from the intro, yes. When I made you, I hid something inside. A poncho. With it, you can release me, and humanity can begin again. Daddy? Oh. Oh my god, this is going to be trippy as hell, and it's going to be amazing. Oops. Oh no, I can't go back. Come to me, my child. You're almost there. What have I done? Find me in the red tower. Wee! Help me. Save me. Over here. What have I done? Missing goes. He came back. This is such a cool game already. I'm impressed. I do feel that... Well... I don't know, 15 bucks sounds okay when I say it, but when I look at it I see 17 bucks because it's in Canadian. I think 17 bucks is a bit much, is a bit pricey for like an indie platformer. I, st I still like it. I just feel that 17 bucks is a little bit too much. If it was 14.99 Canadian, I think that would be the perfect price, but then US would... I don't know, I think like 12.50 US would be quite nice, wouldn't it? I go, oh! I probably have to go inside the building or something. <laughs> oh. I've just failed or something, I think. Look at all the, the Sakura trees. Got a key. Hello, young young ones. Let's get this key as well. Hang on, was there anything back here? I can go talk to this guy, maybe? I wish I could sleep. You're alright. Alright, cool. Oh, where am I even? Oh, I'm dead. Where am I going? I have this key. I'll let out this pig-looking man. Whoa. Help. Is he flashing me? That's a bit weird, isn't it? Oh. So I can buy a key. Okay. Aha! I've just got 25 left. What kind of key do I want? I don't have any green, so I'll take a green key. I assume that's what I'm supposed to be doing. So he's a, a shady key seller. That's really cool. I like that. Oh. Do I have two reds? I don't have two reds. Probably should have looked at that before I uh, started using my keys. The keys do uh, the key mechanics are very interesting. Boink. Error. What's this thing? Did I? This sounds a bit glitchy. Oh, I can't. I can't go back and forth in here. How sad. Can't get in there either. What if I like? Nope. Okay, well, I guess I'm not going over there. Did the old ones know all this would happen when I was made? Which old ones? Spooky. That was a good jump there. I'm proud of that. Right, let's continue on. I'm a bit lost now, though. There we go. Well, this looks like the right way. Cool, cool. I feel like, I don't know, I kind of died pretty early, didn't I? <laughs> nope. Oh, this is tricky puzzles now. How do I even get up there? 
Have I missed somewhere I can jump up? Maybe I can jump up there. Up there. Right, okay, so here. And then like that. <laughs> Careful. Oh no! Mother. Fucker! Okay, we can, we can do this. Yay! Yay! Oh no! Fuck. Fuck that thing. What am I even doing? I'm going the wrong way. I'm not a completionist, don't worry. I'm not gonna try and get things. Oh, now I'm stuck. Oh no, I have to jump onto it. There we go. Uh, here. Then back there. Oh. Oops. What did he say? I wonder what caused the calamity. Me too. I'm sure that will be explained further into the game. Old man. Robot. Old oh, It was a trap. You can't, like, spam it to go back quickly. Oh, here we go. Got it? Oh, god, you have to move with it. Holy shit. What a cool idea. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, god, it killed me. How do you even? Ah! <laughs> Hello, come back. Oh, fuck it! Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> I'm not very good at games. <laughs> okay. Good enough. Neat. Oh, fuck. Can I go back there? No! Why would it not take me back? Um, okay. Gotta wait for it to come back. Oop. Nailed it. Hello, old man. Oh, we're gone. We've gone through. Fine. Whatever. Oh, it's a rocket ship. We did it. Take me away. I don't think it's a rocket ship. Got an achievement, the journey begins. Great. Oh. Oh, so that's what I just did. I didn't do very well on it. That was quite a confusing level. Let's just take a look at the forest. Oh my god. Why? <laughs> what even is this? Bugger me. Oh, this is so confusing. <laughs> oh, here we go. Yes! We're becoming corrupted, everything turning to madness soon. How do I... No! Ah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. No. <laughs> Oh, can you jump up there? Yes, okay. And then we wanna... Yes! Oh my god. This is getting too much for me already. This is quite a hard game. Just have a little... Oh, okay, well, we don't have those moving things. Oh! Whoa. I can't go back there? Nope. Oh, I need to go in there. Um... That's all I can do in there. Can I get in there? Yep. How strange. Okay. How far does it move? It only moves over. Oh, I can go on top, can't I? Oh, no, I can't get in there. Oh, can I go in here now? No. Oh, man, I need to stop it about part way. Oh, look, right there. No. What am I doing? I thought this was easier. <laughs> I can't get anywhere. Oh, hang on, I can go in there. 
Aha. There we go. I think that's everything from in there. Yeah. Okay, now how do I get across? Fuck. Can't jump through there. I'm so bad at games! <laughs> I didn't get these things either. Oh, here we go. Can I jump there? Yeah. Okay. Now I've got everything, but I still don't know how to get out of this bit. <laughs> I can't go through there. I can't jump over. Stop it! Ow. Pretty sure Robbie would be good at this kind of game. I'm not very good at it though. <laughs> well, I think I'll leave the video there for now. Um, because I'm stuck and I'm bad at games. <laughs> but it's a very cool game, it's a very fun game. I really like it. Um, it's not that much like Fez. Fez was all about sort of like rotating the levels, wasn't it? This is about moving the levels on like three different planes. Which I think is different enough. Plus, you're a nifty little robot with a poncho, which is different from a Fez. And that's the bottom line. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Oh, it's, uh, it's the gang members. Ah, oh, you fucking <laughs> head! It's the master the guy! Oh. Come here, come here, quick, quick, quick! We got, we, we're gonna go on vacation! <laughs> ah, he's there with us! My fiction team murder is coming up. <laughs> so, uh, what do you do uh, for a living, Mr. Machete Murder? I murder people. Oh, oh, okay. Do you have, like, a favorite method or something? Machete! Fuck you! <laughs> uh, oh, God, I got hit by the car. I smashed my hand right on the... No, 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 no! <laughs>